Welcome and welcome back to another video. If you are new, hello, my name is Shali, and I'm so happy to have a video up because it's been a hot minute. Hopefully, I can upload for you guys more often. Hopefully, the quality is way better than before. So, for today's video, I created this glittery um, look. This is the trend that's been going on on Instagram, like everywhere. So, why not? do it on my channel like this is what I'm always doing and this is what people always asking me to show them how to do even though it's like all over Instagram but I'm gladly to do it so let's begin so as usual I have my eyebrows done the products I use for my brows and the concealer I used was the Pretty Vulgar, um, what is it? A gel eyeliner, which looks like this. And then I used the NARS concealer. And I used the Caramel, which is a medium dark. For today's look, I'm going to use the Morphe 35M palette, which is called a Boss Mood. See if I can open it which looks like this I don't know what look I'm going for but I want something glittery and dramatic I want to jump off camera and do this eye first and then come right back and show you how I created what I created now this is the look that I did I know this look is real trending and everyone is doing it but that's what everyone is asking for so that's what I'm going to be showing you guys how to do because that's my color really our first shade we're going to be starting with this dark purple so before I start applying colors I want to make sure there is no type of creases in my lids and for today's brushes I'm going to be using all morphe brushes what I'm doing is just packing the color in following my eyeball basically i don't want to go too high i'm staying below my crease what i'm doing is packing it in and making it as pigmented as i can oh i look crazy i look like i just got punched once you pack that in to blend out the edges the brush will blend it out like by itself like very like well blended a fluffy small detailed brush to apply that to the area where it is blended on top of that so then we can start blending everything together you have those two colors and compare it for the other lighter shade So now I'm going back and I'm just making sure this is pigmented. This is the other for pink shade. And now what I'm doing, I'm taking alcohol to clean the brush real quick. I'm just going to cut my crease with the glue. I'm using the duo glue to apply the glitter. First, I'm going to be applying the chunky glitters, which is like this right here. Be applying it like all over my lids. This little thing to pick up the glitter. I'm gonna dip it in the glue so it can stick. I'm not gonna be applying too too much because I'm going to be taking another glitter and this chunky glitter I got it from five and below believe it or not it looks really pretty 
pink is really a beautiful color got this glitter from glit your life and it's called unicorn find that all over my lids it's like crazy so much glitter in there i'm just going to be applying our lashes and then i'm gonna be right back so now that I'm done moisturizing my face, I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. But I used the pond because I have very dry skin. That's just what I use. I actually don't prime my face, but because of this weather, it's very hot outside. I don't want my makeup to be melting on me. So I am going to be using the No Pore Blem Prime Essence from Touch and Soul. And I got this on my boxy charm this month. I do have a tan. I have to use a different foundation. I am definitely going to say it right here, right now. I have to look for the Superstay Maybelline foundation in my tan shade. Because that's like my favorite foundation. Maybelline Fit Me. And I'm in shade 330 right now. And you know what's so crazy? Look at my face. My face is darker than my body. Beauty Bakery Blender. Okay, so now that we have our foundation, we're going to conceal our under eyes. And I'm going to be taking the NARS. So I'm going to let that sit in for a little bit and now I'm going to cream contour. The Infatible L'Oreal in shade 412. Is it 412 that I use? Yes. As you can see as I go, it creates that guide already. And whatever excess I have left, I just Blend it down here. I'm going to be taking the airspun um, powder. I transferred it here because that is a very messy powder. And slowly like press that in. I'm going to be taking a fluffy brush to also set everything else this is the first time i'm using a brush to set my face and it looks really good go with my bobby brown bronzer so now i'm going to be spritzing my face i'm going to be applying the blush to mix all three shades before I do apply the highlighter, I want to cut and make it look sharper. I'm going to be taking Artist Couture in Summer Haze. I'm going to be wetting this. And now what I'm going to be doing is um, line my lips with a brown liner. So I hope you guys enjoyed how I created this look. Make sure to like and subscribe and make sure to share. I will definitely appreciate it. I'm still trying to reach 100 subscribers at least. So I can start doing giveaways in every hundreds I make. So any other makeup looks you guys want me to create, just let me know down below or hit up my Instagram um, on Glitz of Shali. I'll have it down below. So yes, I think that's it.